Hello. Um, I just wanted to take a moment. Um, it's Tuesday, February the 28th, uh, 2023. And I wanted to share something that's been on my heart lately. And that is the power of the divine energy and the flow in our lives. As you know, we navigate our human experience and it's easy to get caught up in a lot of the the noise, the conjecture, the conditioning, the hustle and bustle of everyday life. And we often forget our spiritual nature, the true source of happiness and fulfillment. But deep down, we know that there's more to life than meets the eye. We yearn for this deeper connection with ourselves, with others, and with the universe. That's why the power of divine energy and flow is important and that's where we need to bring it into our lives. We need to tap into this energy. We align ourselves with the infinite wisdom and the love that surrounds us unconditionally. We open ourselves up to the beauty and the magic of the universe so that we can start to live in a state of grace and abundance, gratitude and happiness. To harness this power, we need to let go of the old conditioning and beliefs that no longer serve us. We need to trust in the divine plan that is enfolding for us. We need to open our hearts to the love and kindness that is available for us in every moment. Sound a bit spiritual? Sound a bit evangelical? That's your conditioning kicking back in and right there. Because when we do this, we start to see the world in a new light. We start to appreciate the little things that bring us joy and we start to see the beauty and potential in ourselves and others. So if you're feeling lost or disconnected, I invite you to explore the power of the divine energy and flow. We'll do a meditation in a moment. It's just about taking a few breaths, connecting with your heart and trusting that your being guides you towards your highest good. Remember that you are a beloved child of the universe and that you have the power to create a life of love, kindness, peace. Without the human conditioning, the duality, the control, the fear, we can all be blessed with love and abundance because it's the universe that gives it to us, not just other individuals with ulterior motives. Your mind has been conditioned to always fear the worst, to always think the worst, to stay in your box, to not stand tall and grow. And just think about this for a moment. The universe gives you love every single day, but we write it off, we throw it away, because we're told and we think that we're not good enough. We're told and we think that we can't do this or we can't do that or we're not entitled to this or we're not entitled to that. So when you wake up in the morning and you look out of your window, whether the sun is shining or not, it's always there. Whether the birds are singing or not, they're always there. And it's these small gifts knowing that the universe is there for you, even in your darkest or loneliest moments. The sun will shine and the birds will sing. It's whether you listen to them. It's whether you see them. It's whether you witness them with the grace and with the love and with the abundance that they bring. The sun brings warmth. It brings love. It brings light. And it's there for you every single day, even when it's cloudy. It's still there for you. So take a few moments and find yourself in a little bit of a comfortable seated position, either on the floor or a chair. and Just close your eyes and take a few breaths, inhaling through your nose and exhaling through your mouth. And as you breathe, allow your body to relax and your mind to become calm. Let go of any tensions or worries that you may be holding on to. 
and just simply be here in the present moment. Just feeling the power of your breath. Breathing in and breathing out. And just bring this awareness to your heart, the center, the area in the middle of your chest. And I want you just to visualize a beautiful, radiant light at the center of your heart, just glowing and pulsating to the natural rhythm of the world. Brighter and brighter, every breath in you take, letting go of anything that no longer serves you as you breathe out. And as you continue to breathe, allow this light to expand and fill your entire body. Just imagine that you're surrounded by a cocoon of pure divine energy that is both beautiful, powerful, but gentle. And just feel the love and warmth of this energy as it flows through you, healing and revitalizing every cell in your body. Just allow yourself to be completely immersed in this energy. And know that the universe has your back. You are safe and protected at all times. And now I want you just to set the intention. Just set the intention to connect with the infinite wisdom, the love of the universe. And visualize a beam of light coming from above, entering through the top of your head and flowing down through your body, merging with the light in your heart. As this light fills you up, you can allow yourself to receive any insights, guidance or messages that may come to you. Trust that you're being guided towards your highest good. And as the sun comes up in the morning and the birds sing throughout the day, you know that the universe is supporting your every step. But now, you've awoken. You can see it. You can feel it. You can be it. Feel yourself connected to that divine flow which holds you, which brought you here before all of the conditioning, before all of the humanism, before all of the dogma, the fear, the control. You can now sense the true spiritual energy, the one that sits inside you, that every single day yearns to be at the front and not at the back. So make that switch right now. Bring your highest good, yourself, your soul, your divine light and energy to the front. And allow everything else that no longer serves you to the back. And just take a moment to appreciate the divine energy that surrounds you and know that you can tap into this energy at any time. Simply by connecting with your heart and setting the intention to receive. May you be blessed with all the love and abundance that the universe has to offer. Be love and give love. Have a wonderful day. And when you're ready, you can take a nice deep breath in, wiggle your fingers, and just come back into the room. But in doing so, in a bit more of a gaze, with an understanding, that no matter how much your human life can disconnect you from the universe, the truth, the energy, you can put yourself right back there like you just did. Take care. See you soon. Bye-bye.